name is Tamara Janis and this is one of my practical assessments for the Queensland Off Track uh, Certificate. This is my first horse, his name is Gabe. Um, observing him, he's a fairly quiet quarter horse, he's nine years old. Um, body language, he's alert watching the camera person, um, but he's aware of what I'm doing, he's not running around silly or anything like that, so I'm happy to go in and In here, obviously these are metal yards, so um, I don't have to worry about electricity or anything like that as a hazard. As I come in though, um, I'm going to make sure that I'm facing him, give him a good cat, close the gate uh, so that it's not open before I catch him. I'll hold him here, make sure that's nice and snug, make sure I don't have any loops around my hand. And we're nice and halted, so we're going to open up and lead him through to our round yard. So I'm going to open this gate up, walk him through. By walking through, I'm just going to turn around so that I can close that gate. Using voice commands as I'm asking him to walk on. We've got a few puddles out here. He's a seasoned trail horse, so I know he's okay with water. Um, if they weren't, they would just take a turn at ground or maybe not bring them up to the round yard today after the rain that we've had. over here uh, to the bailing time. That way if he wants to pull back he's not going to injure himself. Um, that would just break if he wants to, to pull back. Um, we'll give him a quick groom today so that he's ready to go to be saddled. Um, hazards in here are very minimal. It is a sand round yard but we do have a few puddles here to be aware of so we're not going to take anything crazy where he's going to slip or fall. Um, we've got the mounting block, but it's well out of his distance. Nice open area, um, so I can get away, he can get away, we're not going to um, compete on each other's space. Um, yeah, I think that's probably all the hazards we have in here, which is, like I said, very minimal. So I'm just going to grab a brush and a hook stick. Um, Gabe's pretty clean today, he has had a bath recently, so... Um, just give him a quick curry comb and body brush just to make sure that there's nothing, especially under this saddle area, up under the girth area. Good boy. Good boy. The whole time I'm going around here, I'm letting him know where I am. Um, around the back end. Good boy. Come up at the other side so he knows what I'm doing, talking to him. Like I said though, his temperament's pretty good. He's a nice... 10 year old quarter horse, um, easy to do most things with. Um, he doesn't really have a mane to groom today, but he does have a bit of a tail, so we'll give that, give that a groom. Just got a mane and tail brush, starting at the bottom, staying off the side here so that I'm not um, out behind him. Oh boy able to be kicked out there. If I'm here, he can sort of just bump me and not actually give me a full kick. Uh, we'll go to picking up his feet. Sometimes you can be a little bit funny picking up these front feet. Oh boy. I always like to just give them a little bit of a shake before I go to picking them out. Make sure he's going to hold it himself. Oh boy. Giving me a little bit of a nuzzle there. Good boy. As I come down to the back feet, let him know where I am. Good boy. I make sure when I'm picking those back feet out that I'm facing this way so that if he was to kick me, I can easily step away. Go around to the other side. Good boy, run my hand down. Pick up. Good boy. Go back down. Last one. 
Oh, done. Good boy, Dave. Steady. Is that it? Thank you.